Danger Dolan. From quasars to mysterious donut shaped rocks appearing in photographs, these are 15 strange and bizarre things one might find in space. Things so massive in scope we may never fully understand them. Number 15. Hypervelocity stars. The common belief is that shooting stars in the sky are meteorites burning up in our atmosphere. The reality is, shooting stars are extremely rare, 1 in 100 million. In 2005, we learned of a hypervelocity star shooting out of our galaxy at 530 miles per second. It's theorized once a planet reaches the center of the galaxy, a supermassive black hole, it's ejected with such force that all we see is a flash in the sky. So it's a good thing we're so damn far away from the center. Number 14. Antimatter. The particles that make up normal matter, you, me, this internet video, also have an opposite version known as antimatter. An electron is negative, but a positron is positive. When matter and antimatter collide, they are converted into pure energy based on Einstein's famous E equals MC squared equation. It's believed this might fuel futuristic spacecrafts. Number 13. Quasars. These are lights shining in the distant parts of the galaxy. Quasars release more light and energy than hundreds of galaxies combined, and the general consensus is that there must be monstrous, supermassive black holes at the center of distant galaxies, although their scope is beyond what we could possibly measure. Number 12. Gleis 581c, the two-faced planet. You remember one of those super Earths they announced a while back? Well, technically life could live there, but only one very small part of it, a ring. You see, one side of the planet is continually bathed in heat from the dwarf sun in its system, but since it is so close to that dwarf sun, it puts out so much heat that it would vaporize you or me. Whereas the other side of the planet is bitter cold, so therefore if you plan to visit there sometime in the distant future, you may want to stand in between these two extremes and suck in your gut. Number 11. The Cosmic Microwave. Although the Big Bang hasn't yet been fundamentally proven, Cosmic Microwave Background Noise, or CMBs, were first detected in 1960, radio noise emanating from everywhere in space. It is suggested the only way this radiation could be everywhere is due to a colossal explosion, one that formed our universe. As we drift further and further into the dark recess of space, radiation should lessen. Number 10. Sagittarius B2. We have only recently gathered the technology to be able to see the center of our universe, and we found something interesting. There's a dust cloud known as Sagittarius, and according to well-educated theories, it should taste like raspberries and smell like rum. The gas consists of ethyl formate, known to give raspberries their flavor and rum its smell. You can't drink or eat it though, it would kill you. Number 9. Dark matter. This is a theory, but a popular one. It goes that we can't detect dark matter with currently existing technology, but that it exists, and it makes up the bulk of matter in our universe. Candidates range from neutrinos, to invisible black holes, to a dark universe-sized bedsheet, although some scientists question its existence. Number 8. Gliese 436 b. If you thought the two-faced planet was bad, Gliese b is composed entirely of ice at 439 degrees temperature. That's right, it's a fiery inferno planet made of ice. The only reason the ice can stay solid in this heat is purely because gravity locks it in place. Molecules densely pack so they can't evaporate. If you are visiting, I recommend flame resistant skin and some thick fur boots. Number seven. The Jelly Donut. On Mars, the rover has gathered a vast array of photos, but this one spikes some interest. In the span of a few weeks, two separate photos were produced with a mysterious rock appearing as if from nowhere. Theories range from a fungus to a donut to aliens checking out the rover, but most people chalk it up to the rogue rock the rover happened to kick up as it drove. Number 6. The Planet Made of Diamonds, 55 Cancer E. Once a star in a binary system, but its partner began to cannibalize it. The star wasn't able to pull away its carbon core, which turned the planet's surface into crystallized diamonds. It's worth, if we could harvest said diamonds, 22.9 nonillion dollars. A nice little profit. One third of the planet is pure diamond, and unlike Earth's atmosphere, Cancer relies on graphite, diamond, and other silicates. If life evolved here, it would look like a vampire cloud from Star Trek. Number 5. The Nazi Space Station. This was seen through Google's map of the moon, a V-shaped object complete with lights. This is no small object though. 
on Earth, it would be two or three times bigger than traditional spaceships. The lights lining up to a V-shape indicate a very strange formation, one we can't be sure of yet. But if it is a Nazi base, suffice to say they're a bit late to the party. Number four. The X-shaped spaceship. In 2010, the Hubble telescope discovered a strange object hurling through space at over 10,000 miles per hour. Most chalk it up to two asteroids colliding to form a strange shape and tail. But what has never been seen before is that the 460 foot wide nucleus is outside the dust halo, separate from the light trail. But they don't have enough data to make an accurate call, and the shape is indeed quite strange. Number three. The Himiko Cloud. This may look like just a shapeless purple cloud, and it is, but it's also one of the earliest objects ever found, dating back to just 800 million years after the Big Bang. It's also huge, half the size of our Milky Way in one colossal gas formation. This cloud gives scientists a vague glimpse into the early formation of galaxies, a mysterious blob discovered from the dawn of time. Number two. The Mickey Mouse, Mercury. NASA snags a photo of the planet's surface and we find, strangely enough, the logo of Mickey Mouse. Disney has neither confirmed nor denied rumors their marketing budget has exceeded the technological advancements of man. Number one. The Large Quasar Group. We have talked about the quasar, but here's one that breaks the laws of astrophysics. Our galaxy is 100,000 light years across. So if you look at the night sky, it's a photo of tens of thousands of years ago, and it would take that long for light to reach us. The Large Quasar Group is 4 billion light years across, and according to the laws of astrophysics, the maximum depth any structure in this universe can attain is 1.2 billion light years. It's a mystery, one that persists to this day. That is it for this countdown. Have a good one.